so it's been raining a lot lately. But today we have no rain. We don't have any sun either, but no rain. So I opened up my fridge recently and I noticed that I had a lot of black and white medium format film just sitting there and an idea came to me. So today we are headed to the Taipei Botanical Gardens. Um, the idea I had was to shoot the flowers there in black and white. I don't know, when people think of flowers they remember the color. kind of want to look at it from a different perspective. Hold on, let's, let's check out the map real quick. See what we got. So we're starting up here. Maybe we'll just make a little circle. Start with the lotus pond maybe and then make our way around. Yeah, that sounds good. That sounds like a plan. I love these little plaques they have in the ground. They're beautiful. Another one over here. I'm guessing it's probably just all the different plants and flowers you're going to see around here. I like this one too. Some of these leaves with the with indents on them, I think. If we can get a shot with it kind of all clumped together, it might be pretty cool in black and white. There's a group of photographers over there. I think they're waiting for birds. Ah, it's nice to be able to get outside. Finally. And we even got a little bit of sunshine today too, which is, look, look at that. Which I haven't seen in a long, long time. This is, this is exactly what I needed. Very nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Gotta keep moving, gotta keep moving. Ooh. Gotta keep moving or else the mosquitoes are gonna get me. This chair looks pretty comfy. Okay, let's see, I still have about 
six or seven shots left. Let's kind of slowly head back. And this is a dead end. This is what happens when you walk around with no real sense of direction, I guess. Whoa, it's pretty gnarly with all the flashing. Then in. Oh yeah, fantastic. That sound means that sound means we're all out of film. So I finished three rolls today. I only brought three rolls. I didn't want to shoot too much, but um, all in all, it was a pretty fun day, except for all the mosquito bites. So check these out. That one's just part of my elbow. Usually, when the mosquitoes start coming out, that's when it's time to go home. just got the photos back and I love them. I definitely loved how they turned out. And after looking through these, if I had to choose my favorite ones, I think it would be... I definitely like this one. I think this one just looks like a painting or... and there's a timelessness to it that I really love. But this one kind of caught my eye because if you look closely, yeah, you have kind of the two ants meeting in the middle there. And that's a nice little detail and I like kind of how they're backlit so their outline is even more clear. I actually loved how these turned out. Um, when I was shooting, I wasn't really sure what to expect, but looking at them now, I think most of them are actually pretty interesting. Um, it definitely has made me appreciate shooting in black and white more. I think when I went out there shooting, knowing it was going to be in black and white, my eye was looking for different things. Oh yeah, let me know in the comments if you have any ideas of what else we could shoot in black and white. I don't know, I had a lot of fun doing this. Um, I think we can do more.